My name is Meg and I am a sucker. Why do you ask? This is why. It has this cute little anime guy on it. Listen, I do the noodle show and I saw an ad for this and I thought, why would I not give it a shot? Let's rip it open and see if it was worth it. You scissors like an animal. Here we go. The initial open. I can't even see. Everything is arranged so cutely. Oh no, I can already see oysters. This was a mistake. Oh no. <laughs> okay, let's dig through it. First off, we have our Umai Crate pamphlet. It tells you what's inside. Okay, I gotta stop reading this because we gotta just go through it. Our recipe is creamy peppercino udon. That looks good. That looks tasty. That looks like a delight. I'm gonna make this. My bonus gift. It's this stuff. It kind of just looks like a creamy, cheesy, parmesan-y, peppery powder that turns into like a creamy sauce. I don't know. I'm gonna use it. All right, the first thing we've got is, looks like rice noodles. I'm gonna have to refer to the um, cheat sheet. Harusame noodles, known as cellophane noodles or glass noodles, which have a versatile profile to use in many dishes like salads, stir fries, and more. So I think that they're like crispies that go on top. They're not like boil them and make them noodles. Interesting, okay. All right, next we've got this cute little guy. Sakurai Foods product. Vegetarian ramen with miso taste. I mean, I would probably buy this off the shelf because it's got this cute little guy on it, but everyone knows that that's how I buy my ramen is on how cute it is. All right, next up we've got a bag of Rice Krispies. This is a tenkasu bag. Crunchy bits of deep fried flour batter. I think another thing that you like sprinkle on top to add a little something, something. Where are my noodles? This is all like bonus stuff. Okay, so, so far we have two toppings and one noodle. Next we have something with pork on it. It actually goes this direction. Non-cup kitsune udon. Next up, tonkatsu flavor. I can read that. Oh, it's cute and pink. Look how cute and pink it is. Haka tonkatsu ramen for vegan. How does a person make vegan tonkatsu? Even in the picture, look, even the picture has eggs and pork in it. So I have, I'm gonna put the doubt button on this actually being vegan. Or if it is like, I don't know, I'm, I'm gonna have to try it. What the heck is this? Looks like a salt shaker. I literally don't even see this on the cheat sheet. What are you? It has 21 calories, so you eat it. I wanna open it and sniff it, but I'm scared it's gonna be some kind of like perishable. Cheat sheet tells me nothing. What is this? I mean, it's super cute. Look at the little like rainbow. This is a bad idea. It's gonna be fish powder or something I don't want. It's so cute. Oh wow, it really is just like some kind of like powder. What is this? I mean, it's red, it's gotta be spicy, right? Some kind of spicy pepper powder, Japanese cayenne. All right, this one has 171 calories. Is that true? I've never seen calories that low on an instant noodle. Oh, yikes. Small udon matsutake mushroom taste. I'm not like a huge udon fan and I'm even less of a mushroom fan. It's gonna make my whole house smell like feet. Next we have, has a little inari on it. Kazami aged tofu udon noodle. Man, this box sucks. I realize, I realize this is like a personal taste thing. I've already said I'm not a huge fan of udon. Tofu is such a waste of Time. It tastes like nothing. It absorbs whatever taste is around it. And so it's it's like a sponge food. It's not enough to carry an entire bowl of noodles. Ugh. Okay, I'm calming down a little bit because it does say that it's at least fried tofu. So it might be like a nice crunchy addition to the udon. Maybe. Okay, time for the last one. Yay, this is the one that I saw when I opened it. Even just looking at the package, I'm like, no, thank you. Dashi ramen salt taste. Oh, clam dashi soup base. All, all this video is gonna do is make me sound like I'm super, super picky and I'm not. I'm a moderate amount of picky. Clams are one of the flavors that I can tolerate as far as seafood goes. I like fish a lot, I'm not a seafood girl. Like clam chowder though, I love a good bowl of clam chowder. So maybe this is okay. <laughs> And that's it. That's 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 the whole crate. We are at a whopping six packets of actual noodles with three ramen and three udon. No stir fry or chow mein noodles, which is what I would have wanted. Honestly, the outlook is not good right now. I'm mad. <laughs> I'm so mad. These are really expensive for such a small amount of ramen. My, my preliminary rating is like a big fat two out of 10. 
I'm not continuing this subscription. I'm not renewing it and I'm not buying it again because of this. I can't even be dissuaded by the cute tiger inside of the box. That's how angry I am. Oh man. Well, look forward to me eating these for the noodle show. Because I will. I'm gonna try them all. Even the mushroom one. And until the next time I decide to do something this frivolous, stay sweet. Six freaking noodles. Are you kidding me? Do you want to see my hands? Do you want to see me like open it? Or do you want to see my face? I mean, I want to see my face. Who doesn't, but... Hi, Eleanor. I'm a sucker for everything that's cute. Have fun. Love you. Love you.